I just enjoy playing paintball. It'll never lose that flair. You pick up that paintball gun and you go out there and you play it, you're gonna have that excitement over and over and over again. It'd be great if we could get paid to do, do what we do, um, but right now that's just not in the cards. You just smash down that guy on the other side of the field to where they don't want to play you guys anymore. There's nothing better than stabbing someone. We turn it up your notch right now. We do not stop punching. There's a feeling about it, and everybody who plays it knows that feeling. That's why they hooked on it, that's why they love it so much. In 2004, I joined the Ironmen, but prior to that, I didn't even play on a, on a team, on a national team or anything. I, I used to play with my friends. I didn't even own a gun at the time. I was just borrowing from friends, you know? To play in a pro tournament was huge and to travel and to be in the professional scene was a dream come true. And it was a whole new level, it was a whole new experience. It went from zero to 100. Brandon Short is, is an amazing, phenomenal paintball player. He's learned, he's come leaps and bounds from what he used to be, you know? And he's, he'll even say that. I play the snake, and the snake's really demanding on your body. It's, I'm diving, crawling, diving, crawling, diving, crawling. It just catches up to you, you know? But right now we need him in one position and he doesn't like that that much. You know, he doesn't want to be just the snake guy. He wants to be universal, but you need a weapon and he's a weapon like that. So, we're, you know, we're not going to change him up, put him somewhere else. You know, we send that kid to the snake, he's going to shoot a couple guys for us every time. If you let him in the snake, you're not going to know where he is because he's good at hiding and uh, he's good at down the tape, you can't put him in. Basic snake, you need to go from start to finish, and you need to cause as much problems as possible. You know? Hanging out in the back, trying to shoot people across the field isn't what's going to work. You need to get down that field, and you need to make it happen. Staying alive is not important. Going down there and killing your three guys is what it's all about. It's for the team.
hooked up with third game, I dive in and my arm dislocates out of the pocket. I'm sitting there now, not even really in the bunker, about five feet off it, in pain, in the worst pain of my life. I remember sitting in my bunker thinking, oh man, this, this could be the end of my paintball career. So I'm holding myself and I finally snap out of it and realize, hey, this is the third game of the World Cup, you know, this is it. But I stand up and my arm goes right back into the socket and I was good to go. It was good, we won. Rusty Glaze, and he is, uh, he's really come up too. I remember when he just used to have the little spinner hat on uh, the Ducks or something like that. He used to play at Camp Pendleton, him and Gator. He made a name for himself, and he's probably one of the most solid players out there. Without him on excessive, they would have never been as good. Without him on infamous, they would never have been as good. The thing about him is he always plays really cool and collected. You know, even if he shoots a guy, shoots three guys, you know, he's not wigging out and running around trying to do stuff. He plays technical and he plays intelligent every time. Definitely that Phoenix tournament they won where he played really, really well. I mean, I think the game that we played them, he must have shot me three, four, five times in that game. In the league, you see a lot of these guys that have been playing for a long time, you know, 10 to 15 years, and I'm only on eight. So those guys have been in the grind and I respect that and I want to keep going. So once those guys quit, that means I have X amount of years to match that and be equal to those guys. Hey, real quick, guys. Hey, what made us real good at Phoenix is we're all on the same page. Right now, no one's on the same page. We're just out here being lazy. Come out and play like you want, man. So much for the light show. Piss it, I want piss it off. I left Infamous to go join John Ripson on Excessive. We won a bunch of tournaments. We won Denver, Pittsburgh, Chicago, Huntington Beach. But the promises of money that were there from the owners and the major sponsor never got delivered. So I returned back to Infamous with all my friends and all the people I grew up playing with. Folded up the skyline, agreeing on a steep decline. career I would always be a snake guy and I would always be going into snakes but I dislocated my shoulder over 200 times and then kept playing through it and never got surgery so the smart thing I did was just move over to the Dorito side and now I run down the Doritos and now I have knee problems so what are you gonna do? <laughs>
comes to seven man, I usually end up like I can play a middle position to either hold or I can run, run up the middle, bunker them out, and free up our guys to move. But when you're playing up the middle and you go running through there, you got guns on both sides, so chances are you could get shot up from a guy on either side or both guys. And they usually don't stop shooting until you stop moving. Ever since I left Excessive, we never came up with a win. And I came off winning a bunch of events to rebuilding a team versus being on a built team. Finally, we got the right guys and put it all together. Finally, I could talk to the video with a victory without saying we got a ton of penalties. We stayed out of the box and we finally came out with a win. If you're a team scouting us, I guess you just wait till Sunday to play us and then you wait for us to get the five minute and then you go ahead and decide to score. Infamous takes first place, start up 08. I went up to Panalee, which is a guy in the Russian Legion that plays the Dorito side, and I asked him at the end of the tournament if he would want, wanted to swap jerseys. I didn't know we were going to play them in the finals, and we ended up beating them in the finals. When we went and shook hands with him and everything, he reminded me, which was really cool because he's really good and he's a guy that I really respect. The Blonskis date back to the original NXL when it started is when the Blonskis came on the scene and they came on to New York Extreme and they had a whole little group of kids. You had the old New York guys and they brought on these kids and they were like uh, Midgetron is what the older guys called them. There's a whole bunch of little little guys and a lot of guys that were a part of that Midgetron thing have kind of faded out but those guys stayed in it and they really developed themselves as players. And I think being on the Russian Legions really helped those guys because the system's better and the quality of players is better. Whereas New York Extreme was more running chaos and you know the players weren't as good so they weren't able to excel like they have now winning tournaments with the Russians. Does it make you mad that like when you go to a tournament and people will like boo you even though half the team is still from the US? Yeah, that's just funny to most of us. People, some people that don't know that there's Americans on the team so you got counterculture shit like go back to Russia you son of a bitch. It's like I'm from New York. You I mean people are scared of what they don't know and you know, the whole USA, that thing, that shit always happens in the finals. USA versus Russia, you get some rednecks chanting USA, USA. But it's just, we're just playing for our team. We just want to win. Oh, that shit really phase us. I mean, I don't really give a who's watching and like who's counter coaching. It doesn't really matter. I don't listen to them. But it's, it almost like helps us play better. And I think it's hilarious. <laughs> Most kids don't know what goes into winning a pro tournament. I mean, you have to win so many games, you have to be on for so long. But once it's through and you got that first place, there's no other feeling in the world. Cuba lips rolling beyond recognition. Diamond studded teeth strewn like rice at Karma's wedding. The ring bearer bore bad news. I don't know, it's hard this this year with this new race, this seven and shit like that. It's not really X ball, it's more like seven man because. You know, you can't really try things, you can't do the same kind of things you used to be able to do in X-Ball. You wouldn't worry about, you could go 0-3 and it doesn't even matter. But here, if you lose two or three straight points, you have to start thinking about how to rescue that. It's, it's less time, less everything. Hip-hop takes its last breath. The cop's claws vernacular, man's photo on the yellow pad. Then balls the paper into his hand, deciding he'd rather freestyle. Well, you have the right to remain silent. You have the right to remain silent. And maybe you should have, maybe you should have.
should have before your bullshit Yo, manifests. Yeah. Going from NYX to the Russians was kind of like, it wasn't night and day, but the differences were clear, you know, how it's, uh, everything is so much more organized. We were brought on the Russian Legion kind of as a freestyle thing, so we could join it together as them kind of being like robots, whatever, they keep doing the same thing, we help them. Once you get on the team and you play with them and you earn your dues, become one family. Dear hip hop, stop. This shit has gone too far. Stop. Please see that turntables and mixer return to cool her. You definitely feel really strong when you come back. Like I remember once or twice when I came back this year from Moscow. I felt really sharp. Stop. Perhaps you should not have encouraged him to use cordless microphones, but they have walked too far from the source and are emitting a lesser frequency. Stop. Please inform all interested parties that cash nor murder have been included to the list of elements. Stop. We are discontinuing our line of braggadocio in light of the current trend in realness. Stop. They think this shit's body do. Give my regards to Brooklyn. Playing the snake's great. You get most of the glory, obviously. Bart plays in front of me. He usually does most of the killing. I just hide and try to try to bonus all people. But there's nothing better than stabbing something. Sticking people is just like a perk, I guess. You know, I mean, it's not like number one on the list. You know, I just go out there and stab people, but it definitely feels good. Dog, you just got money, but you can't buy shit to not get hungry. These cats can't kind of playing because I love the sport. Some people are saying that there's like a future in TV. I don't think there is a future in TV, and at least not for a long time. So for me, I guess it's just playing for fun, you know. I see through speakers, I speak what's seen, I eat and shed, I sleep and dream, I walk the streets of London like none. Soybeans, it's like that. Mouse, I like Mouse a lot. Um, a lot of crazy stuff, you know, I had a lot of history with Mouse. You know, that kid uh, taken uh, under the wing by Mike Hinman. I don't know if that's good or bad things, Michael. You know, go crazy on you, and you know, but teach you at the same time. When I first met him, I think this was like his way of getting me. He just cracked a bunch of jokes, acted like he was a nice, friendly guy. And then uh, after a couple of practices, I got my first yell at. We lost again. We lost. People are not doing their job. What's hard to figure, man? They're right here. They're right here. They're the shooters. They're going to take all day to score a point. So if we shoot a guy or two on the breakout, we just have to play slow, methodical paintball. Idiots, monkeys without brains, we cannot have on the field right now. There's no mercy for anybody, man, woman, or child. Any team can beat you if you don't respect him and you just say, hey, what the heck, this team, we're going to run right over him. Mouse, you know, he's got a, a great attitude when it comes to winning, which is everything else is unacceptable. He's really good, he's real aggressive. He's not, he's not scared of anything, you know. I feel like if I quit, all I would do is just be thinking about all the times with my friends. We're just kind of laid back crew now. I mean, we're all around the same age. Only half of us can legally buy an alcoholic drink, so that's pretty funny. Uh, <laughs> Paintball's fun. I know I'm not making crap out of it. I'll do it while I can.
usually teams struggle their first game pro, but you, this team should be doing better than they are. I don't know, we're just a team that likes to sit back at the first half, let them get their points, and then second half, play like we should, but it's too late. We're a funny team, man. We can be the best or the worst. If the snake's like a straight down snake and get to their end and see everybody's back, that's the snake I like, the aggressive ones. Your shots aren't going to be there on your side of the field at the snakes. And it's too far away. You can almost dodge the tank when you're trying to shoot at someone across the field. I think more teams are hesitant. They'll stay in snake one and wait for you. Whether I think that's a mistake. If you have the opportunity, why not go all the way down until they stop you? It's all a mental game, so if you think you're going to be hot, you're going to run people down, you're going to get them. If you think you're fast, you can make the snake, you're going to make it. It's all in your head, I think so. If you get in that rhythm, no one can mess with your beat. Almost anything I've ever done since I was younger, I've wanted to be the best at. I like to compete. Um, that's something I really enjoyed doing. Only uh, four teams have won in both leagues, and we're one of them. It says a lot about our team. Uh, we're still very young, still got a long way to go. It's very technical, um, very strategic. RT usually wins things because he's outsmarts people. You know what I mean? He's just is a step ahead of them in his game. He knows what they're going to do and he just anticipates really, really well. The kind of guy when it's two on two that you definitely want on the field because he's going to win it. I've been a big fan of Archie you know, ever since I started watching X Factor play. Um, he just makes intelligent decisions. You know, if you're letting you know, an intelligent player attack you, you know, and just playing defensive, then you know, he can work you however he wants. That's the thing about X Factor is all those guys are, are talented players. You know, you got to beat them as a team. You know, when they got guys like Archie, Dusty, uh, Todd, you know, they're just, they got smart players on the all around. How I got into tournament paintball is my brother and I were out at the paintball field one day and uh, we saw a team addicted playing. We were like, man, these guys are pretty sweet. They're just dominating everyone, punishing people. And uh, it was real funny. The day we were out there, they actually ended up getting in a fight with another team, you know, so that was like really my first taste into tournament paintball. And uh, I was like, man, that, that looks pretty fun. I, I need to get involved in that. Dusty is just, I don't even know what to say about Dusty. Very unorthodox, um, real tall, goofy looking guy, great player. One on ones, he's one of the best guys on the team.
side of the field, I'm going to come get you. Let them know who they're playing. That's what we did whenever I started playing was, hey, man, you just smash down that guy on the other side of the field, drop the hammer to where they don't want to play you guys anymore. And that's the way I take that to the pro level. I don't really care if I get shot a lot. I just want to shoot the guy more times than I get shot. You have to race him if you want to stick somebody, that's for sure. He'll be the first one down there. And he's notorious for putting in the back of people's heads and ear holes and stuff. He's just dirty. That's my style, I guess. Justin is, he's a young player and newer to the pro ranks. I mean, impact overall is newer, but he's already kind of made a name for himself as a very offensive player. He's a small little snake guy, and what makes him dangerous is a lot of guys get in the snake and they, they kind of rush through it and they get shot out of it. He usually gets in the snake and takes his time and does a lot of damage. And he's real small and he's fast and he gets in there pretty easy. He's a hard-working kid he, and he's a soldier. He's a soldier by far, you know. He, no matter what, he takes his beats and he keeps, keeps around him. He is a bad little bastard. He'll go all the way down the field, blow apart a team, right? I think he's a great asset to our team and I think he will be for the next few years. When I was starting playing with the Impact, it was kind of, from there I kind of put everything else in my life on hold and I just wanted to see how far I could take it. I'm seeing things, doing things that I never would get to do. You know, all the people I met are great. You know, all my friends and, you know, people I live with and everything is all paintball all from paintball. My work's paintball, so just just keep going until till I can't go anymore. So. Trust your back, guys. Your head's down a lot. You gotta listen. You got you make a great move. You're hoping that someone knows that you did it and are watching over you. It sucks to make that good move and then just get bunkered out, and then now you haven't made a good move. Now you're just another dead guy. A lot of it's just right timing. If they get up into your end, they'll just, their, their main thing is come stab you up. A lot of times when I get in the guy's end, even if he's on the other side, I'll look for that kill first, get a kill, and then bunker him out. Because by the time he hears your gun and figures out what's going on, or by the time they yell over that you're on their side, you could have already gotten a kill, and then stab the guy up. And then that's two kills or three kills. But if you just go down the snake and stab him out, it doesn't work all the time.
Todd. Me and Todd Martinez have been friends for a long time. We actually, I grew up playing at the field that he played at a lot, which was Camp Pendleton. So as I was new there, we saw Todd. Of course, he's easy to spot. You know, he's a big redheaded guy and he's loud and funny. My first pro team I played on, Todd was on. So we were good friends. Playing wise, he's really explosive on the field. That's one thing I really noticed about him is he can really snap into from being in one spot to another really fast and then make those kills because of it. What's up, mother This is Todd Martinez. I just like a big energy guy. You know, I like to get myself going, you know, get myself motivated. You know, I feel that if I can get going, you know, I can get other guys going. I like it to, like, have other people feed off my energy. But you punks who don't know Air Jordan. Whether I'm having a good game or not having a good game, you know, if you can get your teammates, you know, to stay focused and keep them up. And it definitely helps out the team on the whole. Playing modest while you running up to eBay to empty out your pockets. Socket in the mouth if you don't want to get clowned on Metro. I really kind of played anywhere the team needs me to. I always love playing in the front. I love playing in the back just as much. And X balls, I have a lot of fun, you know, this year, especially because, you know, playing like one of those back center spots, I've gotten to attack the X a lot. nigga in the net, you ain't done with my haircut yet. I swear to God, after fade is this tight. I think this year, you know, what, what I had hoped to see last year was more just that, you know, the team's won for a long time because we have intelligent players. And I'm here with Alex Frazee. What up? <laughs> Then you talk. <laughs> oh. And your kicks on tight. About to pull the fly chick you ever pulled in your life. Then you doing what we doing, and you doing it right. Hey yo, Merce, it ain't all about a cut to me. When a girl takes, you know, everybody's input. You know, everybody really talking to each other. You know, just like you know, we've done for years. You know, figuring it out on our own. Out of trash talk, I dress better than him. Look better than him. You ain't got no style. Keep the pictures going wild with my new new joints. Caught a glimpse in the mirror, can't keep me on point. Finally made it to Midtown. Walked in the ledges out. Got one waiting, so I gotta go second. Checking in with Quan. I, I love to compete. You know, I love to compete. Something I know I shot to win. You know, I've been doing this for so long. I get the most pleasure out of going out and just it's freeing. You know, you don't worry about anything. Just playing. All my best friends play. You know, I get to play with them, compete with them. Mike, just got your whip clean and your kicks on tight. About to pull the fly chick you ever pulled in your life. And you doing what we doing and you doing it right. Now if your fade is as tight as we is on the mic. Just got your whip clean and your kicks on tight. About to pull the fly chick you ever pulled. It, it really doesn't matter who's, you know, who you're playing against. You know, you really just gotta, you know, when it comes down to it, just play your game. You know, there's, there's always gonna be somebody over there, you know, no matter what jersey they're wearing, but it's like, you have to be focused yourself. You know, players are getting smarter, and players are playing harder, and you know, you, you gotta go get people off the field before, you know, you give them the opportunity to come get you. I always don't mind taking a couple extra if you get to run down and blow somebody away. Can't keep taking breaks cause he wanna go eat Then he start taking breaks cause he wanna go speak I should've known better, could've went over the tea But it's all gravy bread Put the money in his hand right now Got me cut like a new man Caught up on my jokes You know, I always try and promote Just being a positive influence on people You know, and just try and be a good guy you know, try and be a good friend. About to pull the fly chick you ever pulled in your life. Then you doing what we doing and you doing it right. Now if your fade is as tight as we is on the mic. Just got your whip clean and your kicks on tight. About to pull the fly chick you ever pulled in your life. Then you doing what we doing and you doing it right. Yeah. It, it, it means a lot to me to, to help out other people. You know, so if I can use anything that I've done in paintball to be able to do something like that, you know, then that means a lot to me. You know, if I can go out and, um, you know, help somebody out and have a good time, you know, because they're playing paintball, you know, or because we're at the paintball field and they want to talk about something else, you know, like it doesn't matter to me, you know, it's, it's just uh, being, being there for somebody, you know, because everybody needs somebody. I was telling Oliver the other day that uh, my very first paintball magazine that I even picked up it was him on the cover, and it said, uh, World's Youngest Pro, Oliver Lang. And uh, being young and loving paintball like I did, I looked up to the guys, I looked up to everybody, but especially Oliver at the time. And it was just a different kind of thinking, Oliver coming from Dynasty, 
uh, really good leadership with a real vision on how to win the overall tournament, not not just be a team that wants to just win every point. You know, it's not about the first gunfight. It's like a team's more important than an individual guy. And he really brought that out in the team. Hey! Buddy knuckles all weekend. Let's go. Together each other achieve more. You know this f***ing game. One, go. two, three. Game! He takes the sport very serious. He's a professional. Where, you know, there's other guys who just play the game. You know, they, they just play. Whereas Oliver, it's his job, it's his life, it's his passion. I really want to follow in those footsteps that, of being a pioneer, of being a, um, a, an ambassador of the sport. You know, I want, to, I want to do that just like Oliver Lang does. I just enjoy playing paintball. It's the funnest thing to do. And I just love running around on the field and diving and getting up there and getting dirty and going and getting people. It'll never lose that flair, and that's the one thing paintball has. You pick up that paintball gun and you go out there and you play it, you're going to have that excitement over and over and over again. There's a feeling about it, and everybody who plays it knows that feeling. That's why they hooked on it, and that's why they love it so much. I, I took one weekend off this week, this whole entire year, that I didn't play paintball, okay? And I felt guilty about it. I want to play paintball every weekend, and you know, I enjoy it. I wouldn't change it. I'd rather be doing it than anything else in the world. Mainly on our team, when everybody just does their job and plays, you know, reasonably good, we win tournaments. Look who's come this far. Look who's pounded. Pounded teams in the ground. That's what I'm talking about. We do not stop punching. Just like that first half, we work right now. We don't go off. Watch game. Figure out what the moves are. Figure out how these things better. Anything you do, if you're good at it, you like it, right? Okay? Now imagine doing something that's incredibly fun and being good at it. Yeah, same, same, same bunkers, same layouts, same teams, whatever. 
But for me, it's a personal challenge every time. No matter what team I'm playing with, I enjoy that strive to win, you know? And it's it's personal thing every single time to be the best at that event, okay, and win that tournament. The only teams that really mess us up are the teams that take ground on us, the teams that surprise us. We're like, oh my God, how'd they do that? Everything goes out of the window, our whole plane goes out the window because the guy made the 50 snake off the break. A lot of people are hesitant, a lot of people, you know, wait. You want to always be playing on your toes, not on your heels. People go, oh look, I can come here and I can stop this guy from making that 50. I go, you know what, get to that 50 first, and that guy's not gonna get in there. If you come at me, you're gonna probably trade with me, at least, or maybe get me and stay alive. When we started playing, we had the most fun ever, and that's why we still play. So go out there, make sure you're safe, have your equipment working, and have a great time. Shit the f out of kids, the little bastards, those evil little paintballs where you go and you just, you just shoot somebody in the f like 30 f times, and you say, Where are you, little? You know, just trying to be a good guy. Archie sucks. Archie, Archie. Are you recording this right now? Long ass flight, long ass food, cold weather. Everything's black. They don't use salt like we do. They use like this tarp. So everything's black. boards don't keep up you got to make sure you hold your lanes snap shooting make sure your your shots are on uh, on key on on shot what the fuck does that mean it's all up here it's all in the head so. no not bad i'm the same thing all of it doesn't know it but i'm a lot better than this a lot better he played absolutely phenomenal. So not say anything about sucking. Dixon and Archer, I think, played on fuel back then, and Colt, they were real goofy looking. Colt always had his sweet parachute pants on. And this is how you get kicked out of the PSP, ladies and gentlemen. Those were actually um, condoms filled with Frank sweat. <laughs> Normally you can buy that on eBay for some you know, decent amount of money. You gotta just sweat them up and throw the greatest professional pinball players sweat at all time at the rest to show them how hard he's working. Just one of those kids is gonna take 
all the good and bad stuff that happens, you know, and you know, fold it all into making himself a better player. And if he doesn't, Mike Hammond will bitch slap his punk ass. <laughs> That's good. Buy the video, damn it. Don't steal that shit. Hey, John! I'm going fishing with my dad! The reason why I brought my sword is because I am Maximus of Destruction, from now on. There is no Todd Martinez, I am Maximus. For this entire time, for the next two hours that we spend together, I am Maximus of Destruction. That is why I brought my sword in case two of you twos get out of lines and I have to slice off your heads and eat them for breakfast. Now play the stupid videos. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's gay fed. Pink gun. Ha ha! I'm you got me and my pink gun! For I am the greatest Russian person to ever come out of the USS Russia! Ha ha! Ha ha ha! First year player, Mark Lancia. I think it's broken. There you go. Oh, oh, oh man. Oh, oh man, that what? stuff's brittle. Is this a blender? Oh, shit. Somebody sharpened the fingers on my Ooh. speed weed. <laughs> Oh, Mark. We're gonna try this again. Mark, put, put, take the loader off, Mark! Pull the whole loader off! Take it off! Just throw it! Chuck it! You know what goes great with aqua? Purple! <laughs> oh my gosh! I just got any powder? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Man, I shouldn't have I need some last gold bond! I totally forgot to apply this morning. Oh, oh don't be. Oh, I surrender. Wow. Ow, ow, you can have oh, all my oh. paint. You can have all just. <laughs> Take that everything was not I got. Cool, man. Uh, next on the figure skating floor, we're gonna have the pirouette. So I, yeah, so I totally busted through the middle, and then I and then I grabbed my gun, and as I was spinning, I twelve fingered this guy like in reverse motion. Oh, the old sock hat. I wearing a sock hat. He must have picked up a 1992 Smart Parts catalog and said, I need that. He called Smart Parts and Alan He definitely like, went bargain, but bargain bin Hello? talking on that one. Hell yeah, we still got them things. <laughs> Nobody, I mean, yeah, we'll send you one for sure. <laughs> no, Alex, don't leave uh, Alex uh, left crazy. early. Crazy. Alex left early. Probably number, another one for one. I saw him. Was that oh. one for one? Oh, oh gotta oh, go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. That's okay. I'm PPL refs ain't gonna catch that. Oh, look at oh, this guy. No. Look at this guy. Tom, I got that. I shot him. I shot that. I told you I done it. You know I'm leading the league in penalties. You <laughs> don't lead the league in penalties, man. I got 37 minutes of penalties for going. Oh man, I'm shot. Wait a second, I shot that. What? <laughs> Talking. But I was just trying to tell you that I had shot that guy previously, and that's the same dude that shot me. I'm I'm the bad guy. Like oh, like Carl. Hot Carl. Tuck and roll, baby. <laughs> Hot Carl. Ooh, ooh. Hot Carl dancing around the field. Hot Carl. Twinkle so toes, slick. baby. Oh, 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 oh. Hot Carl. Oh. So slick. Here we go. So I'm good. Fast. Oh, you, you didn't, didn't see that? Slow oh. I am Chuck. Chuck Swizzle. Chuck it. Sweeze all day. Hey, that guy said he saw all you. Night. This is the life of a Chuck Sweezer. Chuck Sweezer. There's no hit in my pack because I'm Chuck Sweezer. <laughs> Chuck Tweezer! Let me wipe it off now. Wipe it hits up my pack, cause I'm Chuck Tweezer! Chuck Tweezer! My boy Todd? Oh! oh stop stop on Todd. you! Like Todd. <laughs> Get off me, son! Oh, I need my car! Give me me to your head! Uh, I should give that to Yo, you. Yo, is this UFC? Get, he's, like, he's like, boom! <laughs> Get that feeling <laughs> to me! See, he ran over it. me. I didn't kick it, Ethan. He, he ran it. over me. That's Dude. what I'm talking about, son. You know, that's what he's saying. saying. No I'm 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 saying. Oh, Angel. Angel. Big Daddy Angel. Oh! I'm good. 
I still get it. It had rained. And see, what happened was it rained and it was muddy. Yeah, and we, when I stepped on grass. <laughs> but you didn't know that was the top oh. half of the paint was bad, the top, the, and the bottom was good. The pot was defective. Whoop. The pot was broken. So that broken paint? Yeah. Well, the dude, it looks it yeah. looked like good paint. The, no, the paint was there's was something wrong with the paintball. How am I gonna make my own bus? <laughs> you can make the bus. <laughs> and if you make the bus twice in one if section, your team <laughs> makes the short bus three times in one tournament. Ooh. In one, one session, session ladies and gentlemen, would you say from Tom Martinez? <sighs> you guys can have my Hummer. And oh, this is Billy Whoa, Grinage. Billy. <laughs> Trip it in. Trip it in. Fall in. Fall, Fall, in. Fall, Fall in. in, Billy. Oh. Todd, tuck in. Ooh. Okay, Todd, tuck in and shoot that guy in the head. Okay, I know he's there. He's right there. He's where? <laughs> He's on the other He's side. He's where? Where? On the bow? Oh! Wow! <laughs> hey, Dusty. Oh, gotcha. Hey, gotcha. Fall, 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 slip, fall. 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 Oh, shoot yourself. He's gonna. Oh! oh. 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 Penalty box. He fell for the old penalty box in the trick trick. Oh no! Oh, oh no way! That guy totally didn't come out of the penalty box and blow me away. <laughs> Justin Cornell, number one. Brett, oh, oh, I shot myself. <laughs> Do it. I, oh, look at that barrel. That's not going to shoot. But that's how he slides all the time. I love it. I don't know how he doesn't race. shoot himself more. <laughs> I need a flatline barrel. Oh, no. Carl Markowski. No, that's, that's a Russian. <laughs> that's a Russian sniper on the grass. Wow. That's a new technique that they're using that's now. That's a little midget. This is definitely from the school of Malloy. Markowski. Oh, you gotta you get out of here. Dude, that was Carl's patented. I'm going to stand out in the middle of nowhere for no apparent reason. And then when I get shot, I'm just gonna be like, oh man, I can't believe that didn't work. Yeah. My name is Catfish! <laughs> I used to play for the Iron Man, I swear! <laughs> I swear, Catarcilia! R-A-R-C-I-L-I-A! I swear I was in the Iron Man! Ask Dave! <laughs> Ask Oliver! I'm gonna have to call my lawyers. I'll come back tomorrow! <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I am so good. I am so good. I am so good. Things are not good. Oh my things god. Things just went real bad. <laughs> it blew my back away. Oh, things are oh. Oh, wow. Jesus. Wow. I need Woo. Ah. Woo. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> that was one of the greatest <laughs> deaths, <laughs> glorious deaths I've ever oh, seen man. in my life. Oh, get my pack. Take oh, my jersey. Oh my god. god. Man. There must have been ten of them back there shooting me on the back. How like many? Ten people. How many guys are gonna How shoot me? came through there. Oh, oh man. Is that the team? The whole team. Jeez, did you see all those dudes? Hey, how many hits are on my back? One. Oh, <laughs> gosh. You got something in your teeth? What's happening in your teeth? You need help? If I only had an Allen key. Hey, you got an Allen key? Uh, no. Yeah, yeah, no, Allen key. Here. What Rusty doesn't know here, folks, hey guys, we're that playing we, a trick on him. We placed, <laughs> we placed a hook on the fence, so when he puts his gun next to it, it gets stuck. <laughs> Look what happens. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. Shot damn catfish. Oh, damn. man, catfish got me again. I would have made it you. the Dorito if it wasn't for that darn catfish and his friends. What's the, what, what, <laughs> what happened? Was, what happened? I, what was. happened was someone put the hook on my gun. Oh man! Didn't he see Brett? He could have just chucked it. Yeah, <laughs> but he might have came back shot himself. Yeah, you don't want to shoot yourself. Shot himself in the face. Canadian. How Justin Cornell be. again. <laughs> Justin Cornell. Man, I was just telling everybody about how good you was and how cool you were and how good you played. And then you and make you a short, on bus, short bus twice. twice. It, what, what kind what? of jerk makes a short bus <laughs> twice? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Angel. Angel. I right, watch me shoot the, this dude. The watch me shoot this rookie. I'm gonna shoot this rookie. The goggles. Watch. Bye bye. Do Merch you, Merch you son. Bye bye. Get up Merch off me. Get up off my. Get up off my. Oh, I just got yeah. hit. He's got owned, son. I'm coming out. Let me out. Wiped off. 
Wait, hey, you play on again. Whoa. Oh, oh, wait, whoa. Like, this whoa. Means I'm now, out, right? now I'll pull you out. Uh, this means I'm out, right? Yeah. Well, I shot that guy. That guy was gone. That was my boy. I see him. Yo, March, baby. Ah, my face. No one is safe from the short bus. Sewers, baby. Nobody. Sewers. Oh. Oh. That guy's dead. There's no way he's gonna come around and shoot me. No one's hit. No. Oh. Hey, Bobby. Hey. No, oh, Bobby. Whoa. What's going whoa. on? I'm good. What? All right. Are you completely crazy right now? With him? What about his suit? Oh. oh. Yes. Oh. Look at this. Look at him. He's hitting the corner. Oh. 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 How would you call that? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I will power bomb the shit out of you. I'll pick you up and smash you over my forehead. You silly little petty NXL ref, Gordo. <laughs> Damn you. He's talking. He's talking. He's talking. I'm not talking. He's talking. He, he was talking first. At least. He first talked first. Oh, oh wow. Oh. Oh. I can't see. Lemonade nope. face. Help Little help off. Red Am I hit? Hey, what? Am I hit? Where Am I hit? Where'd everybody go? How does yellow look on me? Ooh. Is that OP? OP. OP. That was like his first point. Nick Shows told me to go. Nick was like, go, OP. I was like, okay. So I went. Are you mad at me? Oh, just got his. Loader yeah. shot off. Ooh, bam! Loader shot off. I shot that guy. No, Check his speed feed. I shot it off. Oh, that's not mine, dog. That's I swear not mine. I shot that off there. Speed feed. <laughs> that was, that's just I not mean, mine. That was on the ground right there. Okay. And I'm going to win the game. Sir, didn't you have a speed feed to start this game? <laughs> Look, Watson. I think oh, he got shot elementary. in the speed feed. Elementary shot off. I mean, he started the game with a speed feed. He ended the game with no speed feed. And, and there's a speed feed with a giant orange hit on it in the middle of the field where he was no, standing. No, it's in his bunker. Yo, I was having all sorts of loader issues that day. <laughs> all sorts of loader issues, man. Yo, my, my, my loader. My man. paint couldn't go in the loader. Yeah, man. paint was loader just, wasn't on. Couldn't get any paint out of my... Yeah, yeah guys, I got gun. a different loader. I just can't get the paint inside of it. I just can't get the paint coming out of my gun. I don't know why. Yo, if I had to describe the speed of my feed, it'd be slow. I don't <laughs> need all that. That's excessive. And let me load again. <laughs> I'll get another one. Hey, what else has got kids? Do yeah. not do what he does. All right, yeah, it's cool. Don't I don't follow him. I got, I got like twelve of these things. I don't I got like twelve. Look at, I don't even need that much. Look at, like see the ground next to me. That's if what I'm talking about, kid. Do not go. If there's one thing I cannot do, is load paint. Load. I kill people. I, I shoot people. people. I bunk of people. And I put paint on people. I just can't get. The paint I put paint on the ground too. I just put paint on the ground. <laughs> Tons of paint on the ground. Man. Definitely, definitely <laughs> didn't buy Five Max. Five pods my pack worth. Definitely didn't buy Max's DVD. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lay my gun down. Okay, guys, I'm gonna break out. I'm gonna run out, lay my gun down. Ooh. Damn. Pick it up. Run to my bunker. And then dive. And oh, oh man. What, How you gonna make the same clip? <laughs> you two guys need to walk and go run some laps. <laughs> you guys go run some laps. Ooh. I don't, and I, then you get. I didn't get, I didn't get low enough. Didn't for, get uh, yeah, for $5.99, you can get a roll of duct tape. You can tape your whole loader together so nothing falls out. And you can tape your gun to your hand. <laughs> so it doesn't fall out. So, so it doesn't But then you can't switch, fall out. switch hands. And that's okay. You can just give him Justin Schwartz. Does it. He's on there. <laughs> you know? Are you sure you're supposed to suck start these things? This Dota jersey makes me invincible. If you wear the Dota jersey, then you don't have to go out on any of the paintballs hitting you. <laughs> I'm a Gary. I have no idea why I couldn't pull this giant thing off of the flag. Oh, oh just the yellow part. <laughs> oh, not the whole thing? Just the yellow thing? Ew. Oh, you're not going to make Ew, me carry that wow. back, are you? Yeah. Oh, there's something uh, on my wrist. Yeah, nothing on my wrist. I don't think that was there. Let it all costs. Oh, oh, I'm out. Oh, what? Are you kidding me? Oh, let's go, buddy. He got his friend taken, too. Yeah, no argument. I'm not going to argue oh. with that. I really yeah, can't sir. argue Sorry, with that. Sorry, sir. Call. That's a great call. Didn't mean rep. to, sir. Great call, Rep. Oh, 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 I'm gonna oh, keep oh, going, oh, Rep. Oh, you're in the way. No, why? Rep. No, why? You... Why? Oh, what's go? How many armbands does that guy have on? The heated one. Carl. Oh, uh, uh, heated. Rep. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to put my balls on you. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. The right side's good, the right side's good, the right it. side's good, I... the right side's good, the right side's good. Right side's good. Is right the, side's good. How's the left side? Right side's good. Oh, sorry, anyone know how the left side is? No, but the right side's good. The right side's good. Oh, uh, they, 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 uh, they, uh, uh, they blew the left side. Left, they blew. Who's watching left? Left side's open. The left side's open. 
And there's Nikki Cuba as Oliver Lang. <laughs> the great one. Oh, oh so man. good you don't need paintballs what? in your what loader. A jerk. Why would he why would he <laughs> not throw paintballs in his loader? Uh, God. When you're good, you don't need it. What an idiot. <laughs> idiot. Oh, oh, oh god. This gun I don't sucks. Even, this is stupid. I don't even want to play no more. This gun. My team sucks. sucks. I suck. So I'm out of here. It's fun. It's not even funny anymore. I should have woken up this morning and went and done synchronized underwater basket feeding. Oh! oh! That's the same kid. He's so angry. <laughs> You know what? <laughs> this gun don't work again. I'm continuing to suck. Team sucks. Got, the, the, oh my god, twice! My team sucks. <laughs> I gun suck. sucks. I'm just gonna throw I paint from now on. <laughs> you guys mind if I just hang out here feeling miserable for myself? <laughs> I'm not gonna go anywhere. Hey, shoot my team up. They suck. Bonus ball. Throw your gun again. This gun sucks. No god. Is he dead? Hey guys, somebody killed him! Oh, oh my god! Oh, go prone, oh, let's go prone. Oh, okay, I just I'm lay just here. Pretend you're dead. Uh, Don't run here, the bunker's falling down. Oh god, you just told me not to run, I just told you not to go. run there. Hey, you're out, and the bunker's falling down. Whoop! Whoa, you were, you were going where I was going! Whoop! That's my spot, you totally stole my spot! You stole, uh, oh. it, it's here? I was gonna hey, have he's to coming! My herpes is flaring up! Oh, yeah. oh, that's what I'm gonna oh, do. Man. I'm gonna put these on you, son, next game. Oh, oh dude, I totally shot you, man. I totally shot you. Yeah, get off the field. It was no, fucking dude, sorry, cool. man. Yeah, no, dude, you ran by and yeah. shot you. Just get out. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Did you see that? 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 Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Yes, no, no, yes, no. <laughs> yes. Ooh, Dalton. Oh, man. Look at the dirter guy in the background getting shot. You see that? Well, bam! Oh! Oh, 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 oh man. Oh, oh. <laughs> man, my mama gave me that lens. He, he he was serious when they said drop forward. Yeah. Oh, wow. Ooh, the tank is reversed, I've never seen son. anything like that. That's like Chris, Chris Cross oh, back in the wow. day. It's that so is the tightest. Look gun at that. you could ever get. It it's backwards. It's an angel. See, isn't it so that when you're tucked up in the bunkers, so there's nothing really stuck out, so you can like. <laughs> there's no tucking in. There's no tucking in. You worry about having your elbows out, but instead of putting your elbows out, you just tuck your elbows and hold your elbows to hold your tank up, and you just shoot people down. <laughs> snap shooting. It's all about snap shooting. <laughs> Oh, oh you wow! So right. <laughs> so Jake get a dome piece. I you see a ponytail. Oh, oh, oh wow! Ow. Ow. She, did she look at him? Yeah. She looked at him, right? Yeah, I'm gonna walk. Yeah, so you got me. by, right? He was running. She was like, "Hey, go and get my friend. Well, let's slow go, down. Go stab my friend. Oh, looking. Hey, go go stab my friend. Doesn't shoot him. Yeah. Go stab Looks. my friend in the side of the oh, face. God, that's Oh man, oh! oh. oh. You're really gonna Did, shoot me? That was you that ran by! <laughs> that was you that just ran by me and shot my friend and shot me in the back of the head. <laughs> that was you! I'll see you! He ran on the wire? I was I, looking I was inside. Watching. Oh, yeah, I was definitely not looking more. I was looking inside. I was looking inside when he went. I don't know how he got there. I don't know, look like oh, oh man. But Thomas Taylor told me I was supposed to dive into the snake and then I would crawl <laughs> down and people would take pictures of my mohawk. <laughs> but instead I got shot in the face and the ref had to hug me and carry me off the field and tell me I was going to be okay. Rich was like, it's okay, you're a rookie. You're a rookie now. Go out and get some, rookie. Go ahead. Well, I'm just going <laughs> to you guys stay here, I'm gonna go. You guys stay here, I'm gonna go. Stay here, I'm gonna go. Stay here. Stay here. Was that the Luxury. short? That's the five inch? Oh, man. I couldn't afford the whole barrel, so I'm just gonna play with the back end. A tip. This is a five inch boom. Yo, so you tell me I can get the back now and I can put the tip on layaway? Yeah, <laughs> Give me the back. Let's, let's, let's do Give the back. back. Give me the back. Golly dang it! That's the last time I read the ag forum on HK threads. <laughs> Nation. It's totally ag. He shot me in the face and it was not ag. <laughs> not at all. 
Whoa! And then it was cold. cold. I got shot in my no hand. Way. I got, I like, shot that guy way. in his hand. Uh -uh. Uh, no Timmy way. got shot no in the hand. What's no going way. on with uh, Timmy's hand no right way. there? What, Timmy, where's that hand going? In the uh, dirt? No, we're both, oh, we're both clean. Here. We're both out. We're I'm, both clean. Am I good, ref? We're both clean. Can we're both right? Am I good? I'm good. Is he good? I'm or am I good? Are we clean or are we out? Wait, wait. Hey, I'm you're, just... you're good. You're no! Out. No, no, no. Back in the head. Oh, oh you no, no. Take hey, it. Why would you, you do that? It. I'm cold. Why would you do that? But I shot you. You're you shot me. We're both good, though, still, right? We're both oh, good. Oh, take no! that. Take it. Take it. Take it. I'm going to take him out. Take it. That's some that's a bull stuff. He Cole? said I'm alright. No, no, hell no. Me no, no, no. I shot him. I shot him first and third. He shot him second and fourth. Second and fourth. I shot him. If you count up the refs, you got like five refs. I'm going to go. Don't piece. Oh. I'm going to go. Cole Man, being from ten? Texas. No, no, I shot Cole that being from Texas ain't gonna take people? that kind of shit, right? Is that there. the same dude? Is that the same dude that was sitting there the first time I shot him? Oh, I think blah, blah, so. Blah, 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 blah. But look, oh, one, two, no. three, four. Oh, no. uh, don't so, do that. We got four uh -uh. refs. There's Maybe a ref right five. there. Five. I don't know. Hey, dude, do you have any hits on you, bro? Hey, you were right. Are, Are you, you okay? I used to ref in the NXL. Should you be in there? That guy was gonna whoop your ass, man. Are you man, okay? Man, dude, that guy shot you a whole bunch of times. Don't worry, we got your back, baby. That guy shot the crap out of you, man. Whoa. That's alright. Wipe your hand in the ground. Man, oh man, like both you guys are standing here and I don't know what to do because you both shot each other. It looked cool, I don't really though. know, man. Whoa, you guys both stay in. Whoa, you're both out. Both stay oh. in. <laughs> Rookies. Rookies. Oh, oh, you can't. I have no paint. Oh, 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 so uh, from I the was 858. Like, I was like totally in the snake, bruh. So like, bro, check it out, bro. And it got so gnarly. Bro, check it out. Because I didn't have any paint, but then I was like, um, I was in the snake, bro. Oh. Right? And then the guy totally went to the corner. I totally missed him. When I was like, shot at him and I totally missed him, bro. So I was like, I'm going to go get him. Right? So I was doing the little ringy, 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 uh, ringy. I'm I'm saying. I'm saying. I'm saying. And he shot me, bro. And then what happened? I got shot, bro. Sacramento. Let's go Scaracamento. Runs into oh, long haired, long haired, long -haired. ponytailed guy. Take Dude, green in the face. He, he's he's oh, shooting he's, orange. He's he, not even shooting green. He's still blocked yeah. out. He's still blocked out. I'm good. No, no, no way in the Why are they no. still shooting me? Sacramento didn't shoot me. I shot Sacramento. And oh, are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> There's no way I shot you. I'm way more at. Whoa, hold on a second. Hold on. These guys. Dude, one of you guys. What's has going on? Here, just stay there. Just here. Let me help you out, bro. They shot you a whole bunch of times. Oops. No! Goodness. Night Brandless. night. Who was that? Oh, Ooh, I hurt myself. Oh, okay. Oh, oh Dave Beast! Oh, oh, I hurt my groin. Oh, man. No, I swear. Beast. Oh, I pulled my groin. Oh, oh Beast, you didn't man. See, you, there was a, there was a big of the Punjabis <laughs> bulky behind that bunker Ooh, that oh the my camera God. didn't Ooh. pick up. Sorry, I crapped on you before this. Buy the video, damn it. Don't steal that shit. <laughs>